New information, a mental health organization in North Alabama is trying to save an important program that helps people who have mental health issues from returning to jail. In its first year, officials tell us the program saved Morgan County's taxpayers more than half a million dollars. Way 31's Stephen Dulcizian learned more about the program's success and why it needs help. In the first year, 94 inmates participated in the Stepping Up initiative here at the Morgan County Jail. And of these 94 inmates, only 6% ended up back in jail after partaking in the program. The goal is to lower that number even more and make sure the days of ignoring mental illness are over. Everybody else, they should be concerned. If your loved ones is in there, you should be concerned. That's what one man said as he described how serious mental illness is inside jail. The man did not want to be identified on camera, but says he's been behind bars in the Morgan County Jail and people need help. Everybody is a human being, not because you make a mistake, it doesn't mean you're a monster because you're in jail. The nonprofit Mental Health Center of North Central Alabama leads the Stepping Up Initiative program for Morgan County Jail inmates. A lot of these people that are going to the jail, because they have a mental illness, they can't, they're not working. They don't have the funds to have an apartment or a shelter. Lisa Coleman says the more people the program helps, the more money it saves taxpayers. In one year, we saved the county over $600,000. Those calculations are by keeping those individuals out of the jails for um, so many days. But the longevity of the program is already in jeopardy. Right now, a federal grant and Morgan County Commission are helping fund the program. The first ever Stepping Up for Morgan County fundraiser is being hosted this month to try and raise $80,000 to keep the program going. Sheriff Ron Puckett says this is a time to show mental illness is a focus. We've got to do a better job in our society of taking care of those individuals that have mental health problems. And he wants to make sure he keeps giving help to those who need it. So we encourage them to do that as, as far as the health care for them because there really aren't a lot of other resources for them. In Morgan County, Stephen Delcisian, Way 31 News. The fundraising event will be on February 21st at the Ingalls Harbor Pavilion in Decatur. You can find more information on the event by going to our website. It is waytv.com.